All right, Kyle here. Going to do a quick rundown of the controller and the browser features of the PS3 right now. Um, controller hasn't changed much at all, except for uh, the trigger right here. L and R move down a little bit. It's not really that big. And the USB to charge or to connect, and also the indicator which controller you're using. Also, the PS button. Um, it's used to connect the wireless, and when you hold it, you can actually shut down the system or get out of whatever game and also check your battery level. Um, browser, here's ZGeek. On my horrible TV, the resolution's low, so ZGeek's humongous. Also, the freakiest avatar ever. I think it scares the hell out of me. Um, everything works really well. There's like a T9 input, but you can also put in a mouse and a, a keyboard. To, to do whatever you really want, it's automatically recognized. Uh, left analog stick is move the mouse, right analog stick scrolls. And YouTube actually works straight out of the box, which is pretty interesting, I thought. I didn't, I didn't know it would. Um, <coughs> let me see. My slow connection Oi. isn't facilitating Ooh, my no. demonstration that well. Um, Alright. My name is I'm gonna George. Pull that. I um, you go up. Alright. Now, if I can get the button right, there's all your options, tools, cookies, JavaScript, etc. Windows list, you can actually have multiple windows going at the same time and switch between them. It's pretty cool. Um, I accidentally almost closed out of the browser. It's back, refresh, home, bookmarks, history, all that crap. Alright, that's done.